Good morning, everybody. It's morning. It's morning. It's 7.30 in the morning. And um, we are headed to, I guess so, it's called Truett's Grill, but it's a Chick-fil-A. And I guess that's just how they do it in the South is. And it's a buffet? They, they, they make it a little fancier, Chick-fil-A. And the outside of it looks adorable. Yeah. And Jordan and Robert had to bang on the door this morning to wake us up. Not bang. They oh. knocked. Not loud. Um, because because we're us, and yeah. it's funny. They're like, "Well, we just remembered from the vlog you saying you had a hard time getting up," and we're like, "We just like I think we need to just like switch up our alarm because I, yeah, I, I think feel we like we just like need, tune it out." I think we need one of those like twenty dollar ones off Amazon where it's like the 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 arm <laughs> banging the the bells. We just need one of those. Okay, so I'll show you the restaurant. in no time. We've been here literally two minutes. <laughs> you alright? It's a lot of food. Chick-fil-A buffet. A lot of fried food too. Yeah. It was like ten dollars a person you said? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not too shabby. I feel like I only have coffee in a little bit though. Yeah. I only had like almost well, two little ones. Did we say already that I stayed up to edit and Peter slept? just in case I did snooze a little bit today. But let me drive! Alrighty, this is a sign in so many ways. Free glazed donut. I'm always craving donuts with the purchase of Red Bull. I need a Red Bull. That's our fund. That's our brook car project fund. Well, wow, it was meant to be. I didn't even, I didn't, I'm only I gotta saw go. it. I gotta go, I gotta go. I bring it with you. No, you gotta take it. <laughs> go. The best part about that was literally I opened the door, the car door to like, be like, oh my God. You're gonna love this deal. And she literally starts freaking out. She's like, what? What is it? Why am I so excited? I don't even know what you're talking about. And I was like, because it is, that is a commercial deal, a gas station deal made for Sarah Ryan, now Sarah Brookhart. Before we head back on the interstate, I wanted to show you as well while I'm waiting for Sarah. Dedication, Sarah stayed up super late to edit the vlog and now we are uploading it via Sarah's cell phone. But right now it keeps bouncing between like 30 minutes, 50 minutes, an hour, four hours. It's 1% uploaded though. In that building, it's right the there. Coke headquarters, which means the Coke uh, Museum is close by, which means <laughs> Beverly is nearby. Beverly is nearby. And we, this is one of our favorite things when we drive through is this Olympic torch statue or whatever it is. Kind of, oh, it's like an observation tower. But it's for the Olympics. Yes. There's Georgia Tech. Smooth sailing so far. Atlanta is known for its traffic, so we're really good on time. And we're usually not, only not good. Not Atlanta known for traffic, as I said, but we always try to plan to go through Atlanta during good traffic times. And yeah. I don't think we've ever come through Atlanta without tons of traffic. So this might be like a first for us. Because we're already down, we're already past like the center of downtown. We were also just talking that it's no Chicago skyline, but we really like the Atlanta skyline. I think it's because like there's a lot of like different unique buildings and stuff and it has like layers. Oh, she's getting artsy with her descriptions. So we're like 50 or 60 miles away from Chattanooga, so like Tennessee borderline. Oh, heck yeah. And uh, full disclaimer for today's vlog, uh, mostly gonna be in the car, I think. Yeah. And uh, if you've been following us along, thank you. If you haven't been, welcome to the Brookhart Project. Uh, we do daily vlogs, mostly in Disney, but every day, so we're gonna be in Chicago for the next week. What I'm trying to say here is, you know, Sarah and I exude just enormous amounts of energy with little to no sleep. We got good sleep on a comfiest bed. Well, I got good sleep. You got a little bit of sleep. I had an issue. I stayed up last night to edit, and then I got in bed and I went on like a YouTube downward spiral and I was up for like... And then we had a great breakfast, Chick-fil-A, buffet, and uh, we got Red Bulls. I haven't had mine yet. Sarah's had hers yet. But here's my worry. This is my disclaimer. We're going to get cabin fever in this car because we're in this car for like 11 hours. Um, so just warning you now. Some ridiculous scenes might come up. Some ridiculous sayings might come up. 
Um, Sarah's already hit the gigs like twice this morning. Yeah. I think I burst out feeling. laughing. No, it's a good <laughs> feeling, but it, and it's crazy because we don't usually go through this portion, this portion of the drive during the daytime. Yeah. The views are just gorgeous, and we're coming up on the mountain, so you know we're about to hit you up with that mountain time lapse in three, two, one. AT&T building, everybody. It's that, nothing. That Batman looking building over there. And then there's meet George Jetson on the corner, right? Peter also went the wrong way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's just two paths. We chose one way and not the way we took last time. She just told me that we didn't take the wrong way. I know. I was trying to build you up and you're like, no, we definitely did wrong. Well, God bless you with the name of Nashville. <laughs> just a humble sneeze. <laughs> That's the Kentucky sign. <laughs> Welcome, Center. Sarah's the biggest struggle this trip so far. It's not been staying awake as much. Or I'm just distracted. Way. It's grabbing the camera last like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. this whole vlog has been like this. Cabin fever. We're doing good. That's 1240. We already went into Central Time. It's, stop. <laughs> it's 1240. It's 12.40. I'm going to stare at you more, then we're going to get that to the end. <laughs> we're in Central Time Zone. We just got in, uh, what, Kentucky? And then we'll be in Illinois. Yeah! Going on time. Peter's festive. With the sprinkles. And I got a double chocolate. Okay. See? Cubbies. Cast member. Jam-packed. Definitely hollow symbol. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Blue skies and sunshine guaranteed. <laughs> Look who's gonna drive. This is the first wow. time. This is the first time I've driven on a road trip since Route 66 and I literally drove for a handful of hours. Before. I don't even think it was hours. I like straight, straight, yeah, right? go straight, yeah. I like the drive. That's why it's not like Sarah doesn't want to or she's like, like I, I'm not driving, you're I driving. I drove downtown every single day for school for five years. I drove us around Disney World when we were on the college program. Like, I can drive. It's just. Oh, you're a good driver. You're a better driver than me, for sure. <laughs> the internet 
earlier and I launched the Seraphon a video, I think on Facebook, it was a YouTube video of like somebody making a video of the proper way to eat an apple. And ever since then, my life has been changed. And Are you gonna do a time lapse of it? You should. No. Yeah, do it. No. Yeah. But I eat it from the butt. I eat it and from. Then you eat it all. And then I eat it all, core and all. So when I'm when I'm done, like there'll be nothing left. Mm -hmm. It's just something I do. I'm gonna see if I can get a good look at time lapse. But I already started. Camera battery died for our G7X. Yeah, so we're on our. But look how big Whoa! these tires are. Okay, see how I get ready to creep, get creeped out? Yeah. See how big those are? Yeah. Imagine how big the thing is that those go on. What is it for? Some construction. Construction vehicle, or military? Aliens? <laughs> Space Force? This actually looks good. Does it? Yeah. There you go, everybody. Right there. We are off the interstate. Right there is a big old water tower for the village of Oaklawn. Um, I will say, it's 7.05. I think this was like the best drive we've probably ever done. Yeah, it was super low key. I think because it was low key and because I think, to be honest, I think it was like three hours. Did you drive for three or four hours? Something like that? Yeah, I drove almost for four hours. So I think that helped me out a lot. Yeah. Violet, don't pay. <laughs> that smile. Dope, Violet. She'll do it. Uh huh. Dope. Who's here? No. Look at her and her. This is her baptism gift. Hey, everybody. You scared me, Maxwell. And she's got this beautiful pearl bracelet and the key to heaven. Look who's back together again. We're buying christening cards garbage cans and we're not gonna buy some video games. <laughs> One in Target. <laughs> One in Target about to go to your child's christening. You skateboard through the halls. Penny board. Penny board, my, my bad. Here. Yeah, there's your penny board. Oh yeah. Well, Jordan and Robert got me this from their huge Braves fans. It's Terra hey, Pin. Need to turn it down. Chops executioner. I'm on it, I'm on it. But they got, they got me this four pack of Chops executioner. The uh, Braves, I think it's like the Braves official beer. Really good, it's an IPA and it's very happy. Christina and Grant don't like it. Um, but we got Call of Duty World War II online. Guys, the struggle is real. It's 12.26 in the morning, but we're doing something different. We had a realization last time out here that with Christina and Grant having Violet, like they go to bed earlier, because the baby goes to bed. Whereas previous trips out, we would just like, or other times in life, we would just stay up real late hanging out. They don't really do that now that they got their little baby. So the last time we were here, we were editing in the morning, which Sarah had the realization was like probably eating up good time to spend with them. So what we're going to do this time is try to edit at night, which means we'll probably stay up a little later or at least we'll have to end the night earlier to edit earlier. And then we have more time with them in the morning. But I, we get a package, which I thought they were going to, I thought they... We're gonna open up, but it got here yesterday, and it's super exciting. Look at this, seven. Seven new, fresh Magic Bands. We got Sue's, Bill's, what is this? Mine, we got a red one. Christina, Grant, Jenna, Sarah. This red and yellow ones are coming home with us, and we may start using them right away. I don't know if Sarah's gonna use hers. But she got, she got a fresh yellow one because her other yellow one that we got with Daniel Pass was getting nasty. And then I got red because my blue is getting worn down, but I just thought I would switch it up and get a blue. Or I mean a red. Cool thing about the Magic Bands is they're kind of as long as they're active, and you can check on the My Disney Experience app if they're active or not. You can pretty much use them interchangeably once they're linked to your name and your account. And since there's nothing really going on, besides the edit, I put on Chef's Table again. My main man... Massimo. 
while he is out. Um, I'm finishing up editing and hitting the hay. Um, oh, I'm Peter. Peter woke up as I signed off. I'm just signing off. Okay. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>